Hello, everyone. My name is Quentin from Beijing University of Post and Telecommunications. I'm here to present our approach for the task six, automated audio caption in decades challenge. The title of our paper is Audio Captioning Based on Transformer and Free Trend CNN. And our code is available at this GitHub repository. So this is the outline. We will first give an introduction of automated audio captioning task and show our proposed system. Then we will introduce our experiments and show the results and finally conclude our work. Let's start our introduction. Automated audio caption is a multimodal translation task. Well, the model outputs a textual description giving an audio singular. So for audio captioning task, it requires to detect objects in audio, understand the relationship between different objects, and finally, describe this information with language knowledge. Audio captioning has a lot of applications, such as audio retrieval, audio information acquisition, and real-time environmental sound description. This is the general overview of our proposed system. The CN encoder extracts a sequence of feature vectors of the input log mass spectrum. And the transformer decoder generates each word while attending to the feature sequence. The experiment is divided into three steps, pre-training, training, and fine-tuning. This is the let work architecture of encoder and decoder. The encoder is a simple CNN which is used for feature extraction of input spectra. The encoder consists of four convolutional blocks, and an average polling is added between each block. The feature vector is the average in the frequency dimension and convert to 192 dimensions by fully collected lawyers. The decoder is a standard transformer decoder, which is introduced in paper. Attention is all you need. In our system, we use a two lawyers transformer decoder with four heads tension. Let's start our experiment part. In automated audio caption, cursor dataset is used, which contains 4,981 audio clips in 15 to 30 seconds, each with five captions in 8 to 20 English words. Along the data set, 16% are used as training sets, and 20% are used as evaluation sets well, the last 20% remains as test set. For audios, a short time Florida transformer with a window size of 1024 and a hope size of 512 are used to extract the spectra. Then, filter bands with 64 bits are applied on the spectra. All captions were tokenized, while remove all punctuation and convert all letter to law case. Then add tokens at the start and the end of each caption to mark the sentence. Before input into the model, all data was zero padded to form a tensor. We find that Direct training with the data provided by the challenge may not sufficient to get an effective encoder, which also makes decoder hard to optimize. So, how can we get an effective encoder for feature extraction? 
In our paper, we design a multi-label classification task to train our encoder. The features got from this task will be used to generate captions. This is the method to get the corresponding classes of multi-label classification task. We count the words in the data set and remove meaningless words. Then 300 words with the highest frequency were selected as classes. All five captions of each audio are combined to form one training label. The label of each audio is a multi-hot vector, where each, each index of the word occurred in these captions are equal to one. To training the encoder, we modify the fully connected layers of the encoder to output a 300-dimensional vector. Sync road activation function is used in the last layer. The loads of the network is calculated using binary colors entropy. In training stage, the weights of convolution lawyers trained in the pre-training stage are loaded. Then, freeze these freeze convolution lawyers to train the decoder of the proposed model. The activation function of the last lawyer is softmax, and the loss of the network is calculated using cross entropy. After training, fine tuning is applied to fine tune the encoder and optimize the whole model. We select the model with the highest performance in training stage and continue to train with a small running rate. In our proposed system, some tricks are added and demonstrate to improve our performance. Spec arguments is applied as data augmentation to increase the effective size of exciting training data. In spec arguments, Ferguson mask and the time mask are applied onto the log mail spectrum as shown in this picture. Label smoothing is applied as regularization to improve the generalization of the model by introducing penalty to overconfident prediction. In the interface stage, bin search with a size of 1 to 4 is used for what interface and choose the best bin size based on the output caption score. The table shows the scores of each metric with different model on evaluation data. In all metrics used, higher score indicates better performance and the result is mainly compared by spider score, which is the mean or between the cedar score and the spice score. The baseline model is the baseline of the case audio capturing challenge. The CN transformer is the model proposed in our paper. And the pre-CN LSTN use a LSTN decoder with attention and the pre-trained CN encoder for pre-training stage. To compare the ability of different decoder, CN LSTN and the CNN transformer are compared with the same pre-training CN encoder. The respective scores are 0 0.187 and 0 0.2. 209. For the same features extracted from decoder, the transformer decoder performs well than STN decoder in all evaluation metrics. We can also say that pre CNN transformer gets a high score than CNN transformer. This result confirmed the effectiveness of our pre training method. Finally, 
fine tuning is applied and achieve a score of 0 0.227 in evaluation data. This table shows the validity of the tricks and the methods we proposed system. Method base is the model without uh, using tricks. Method SA is add special arguments for data augmentation. Method LS is use label smoothing to prevent overfitting. Method PW is as pre-trained word embedding or button through what two vector. And the method PC is use pre-trained CAN encoder or button through the multi-label classification task. Method FT is to fine-tune the model with a small running rate. Look at the last clone of the table. Most methods used can improve the spider scores. This is the rank for all submitted systems. Our system achieved a spider score of 0 0.214 in testing spines. Finally, is the conclusion of the presentation. We proposed a audio captioning system based on CNN and transformer, and use some methods to improve our performance. The system are effective and achieve the second rank in the case challenge. The experiment results show that the features extracted from the multi-label classification task can be used directly for automated audio capturing. Transformer decoder has better language modeling ability than decoder with LSTN in this task. Meanwhile, using spectral arguments and label smoothing can effectively improve performance and avoid overfitting. That's all. Thank you very much.